I developed an amp with Schechter because they're a fabulous company and they let me come in and pretty much just design what I wanted to do. So we basically commissioned one of the best amp designers of all time to come in and do this, James Brown, who did uh, the 5150 for EVH and a bunch of other stuff, but just a, a really brilliant and unique guy. He takes all the, the improper adjectives and everything and kind of translates it into sound and he does a very good job with it, especially me. I don't know really what the hell I'm talking about. I just know what I like. I was definitely looking for, believe it or not, an unbelievably amazing clean. That was one of my number one priorities. I knew he was gonna kill uh, the distortion. I wasn't even worried about that. So I, I really wanted an amazing clean and I wanted this thing to play beautifully. We have two different clean voicings, one being the USA. And then you have your UK voicing, which uh, I probably use this for more rock type of stuff. Another very important thing, needed to have great breakup, great resonance, and so the recommendation was all birch, really fucking thick wood, Celestian Vintage 30s, all USA made, and it just, it cranks, it pushes air, it breaks up unbelievably, and it just has uh, a great resonance to it. The playability got there right away, the clean channel was amazing from the get-go. The distortion, the actual sound of the, of the amp came together really, really fast. This gate was a bitch to figure out. We dealt with this particular type of gate that's not this kind of square thing where it just comes in and out. It's very um, forgiving and smooth and, and delicate, and it just pertains to the, um, to the distortion channels. So basically, if you were to apply a gate on, you know, over the whole amp via stomp box or something like that, it would affect the clean too. And if you have your, if your amp's really, really loud, which we like to get because, I mean, this amp sounds really, really amazing cranked with all the breakup. I mean, it's just, an, uh, yeah, it just sounds phenomenal. But you'd turn to clean and then you'd hear that kind of phasey, it just like really thins out your tone and adds this, this unwanted texture and just, uh, I don't know, I've had troubles with gates before in the past. And it's a great idea, but it was, a very difficult process getting it to actually work. And uh, we had to, to curve it different ways, but we, we got it figured out and it, it fucking works. It goes to basically nothing, you know, but you still get. And nothing.